How's it going everybody? Driver53 here and today we are back on the old stream farm. As you can see, I've been pretty busy. We uh, put a bunch of landscaping in here, made a little bit of a road because I realized I kept cutting through here all the time. We're going to take this cultivator and head on over to our other fields that are already harvested and we picked up all the straw. We got a little bit over 200,000 liters total of the straw. So we're going to go ahead and run over here and get work in these fields because as soon as I get done cultivating, I've then got to pick up some rocks. Now we do have our uh, rock picker over on the other field where it originally was, but we've got a little bit of a different tractor. Not a little bit. Yeah, we have a completely different tractor over there on uh, that rock picker. And the reason is because I decided I needed four tractors. Yes, I know. I'm crazy. Four tractors. Um, we took out a little bit of a loan. You can see that we're still at 165000 The tractor wasn't that much. It was used, um, but we are going to pay that money back eventually. Not right now, though. Um, but we're going to have four tractors running just to at least get us going here on uh, on these uh, these fields and get moving because last week some really cool mods came out. Well, the week before, actually, I was on vacation last week in Ohio with 82 and DJ and all the other great, fantastic people that were there with us. And um, the week before that, some mods came out that I really, really want to start using here on this map because I feel like it's absolutely perfect. To be able to use them and we're going to show them off here in a little bit i'm going to put down some greenhouses i said we were going to do that and then we're going to work on some productions um because i feel like we need to get some of that stuff moving but this is the new tractor right here this is the fint 515 uh c it's a favorite it's um it's a little bit different color than the other one here but i think it's still going to do the job no problem so we're going to go ahead and pull up right here where our rocks are starting at and we are going to let this worker go to town. Maybe. All right. I think once they get up the hill, they're going to be all right. Yeah. They're they're going to be fine. They're they're going to be fine. The weeds though. I'm I'm nervous about the weeds. We're going to have to figure out how we're going to take care of those. But what we're going to do now is run over here. Well, you know what? I'm just going to teleport back over here because we need to put a little bit of lime on our field and this is the original tractor that we had hooked up to our uh, rock picker it's got some narrow tires on it so we're going to be able to um you know use it for fertilizing and lime spreading and things like that and as you can see even with this weight here in the front this thing is weighed down pretty pretty bad here on the back this is the awesome convernland tlx uh geo spread is what it is beautiful beautiful piece of equipment here it comes in two different variations you've got an older one and a newer one we're running the little bit newer one right here so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and it's like a 42 meter spread i'm going to come over just a little bit more right there go ahead and get this going oh as you can see it is a very very wide spread holy cow now i'm probably going to uh run out of lime here just doing this one field and you know what we um uh, we're yeah let's go ahead and crank up the speed just a little bit i think we'll be all right yep all right there we go perfect now all of these mods are available on console as well i'm playing on the pc because my playstation 5 got confiscated by mrs 53 yes it did she's very excited she got a um a birthday present while we were in ohio also and uh, I can't wait for you guys to see um, some of the new content that's going to be coming out here with Mrs. 53. She's going to be using her awesome new pink controller. That's right, everybody. Pink controller for Mrs. 53. For her request. She said she wasn't going to play anymore until she got it. And we had to get it for her. All right, as you guys can see, I didn't even get that entire field finished. So what we're going to do now, run back down here, fill up a little bit more. And then we're going to uh, finish that field off real quick while we got our rock picker going and we have our um, cultivator going over in the other field. And what we're going to have to do here with the last tractor that we have, this one should only be like, one of these should have only been 100 liters. Hmm. I wonder which one this is actually filling up from. All right. Yeah, that's what I thought. There we go. That's only 100 liters. See? I, I knew it. I knew it. 
All right, so we have one more tractor that we can get out. And what are we going to do with them? Hmm. We've got a cultivator. Oh, that's right. We're going to do some mowing, y'all. We have a field that is ready to start mowing. Now, it's down over by the grain mill. Um, and I really want to get started on that project as well because we are going to need to make some TMR. So I need to make some silage bales somehow. Ooh, ooh. And um, I don't know. I, I might use another mod to help me with that. But I'm running out of room on where I can put stuff. So I, I don't know. I want a couple greenhouses. I know that for a fact. And we're going to be putting in a couple different productions, I feel like, to uh, to help us out there um, making some TMR and maybe even making some silage. Omatona's got some really, really awesome mods that I really want to showcase and use and uh, and understand them a little bit better. So what we're going to do, we are going to take this worker right here, run through this little opening here, go up this way, and we are going to let this guy just hang out. What? Why are we missing so many rocks? I don't understand. We missed like an entire section of rocks right there. What is this? All of that right there. And then we start back up again. Worker. What's going on? Hmm. Let's see if we can figure out what this worker is doing. I mean, they seriously missed an entire section. there. It's like only down on that end, though. Huh. Well, maybe I'm just going to let him keep going here, and then we'll get that worker over here spreading this line. Um... Yeah, let's go. Let's go get over to our mower because I want to get all these things going and then we can uh, we can start sorting out all of the details. So this is our mower right here. Perfect. We are going to go ahead and unfold this thing. I think it's going to be all right. I think I don't think we're going to have too much weight on the back end, but this is a pretty big field and I really need to get that area down there cleared off. because I think I'm going to put a factory down there. I don't know 100% yet, um, but we might. All right, so lower it down, get going. All right, and I'm going to leave this wide right now because we are going to come back and we are going to TED some of this so um, to make hay because I need hay for my TMR. All right, I think really just uh, TMR and, uh, or uh, hay and um, silage, it may be the way that I go if I get a mixer. But if I get one of the buildings that I showed off, well, I haven't showed it off yet. Actually, it's in a future video. That's right. We're going to be taking a look at the easiest way to make TMR um, for console players. I, I found a mod that I really, really like. I can't wait to show you guys. Can't wait. So stay tuned for that. And uh, well, maybe it, it might actually come out before this video. I can't remember. I can't remember what the schedule is, but either way, um, Check it out. If you haven't yet and you're watching this video, go check out the easiest way to make TMR. So we are going to go ahead and come all the way around here. Why was that skipped? That's very odd. It must be a dip. It must be a dip. So I'm going to keep going with this headland. This wow. Now I understand why it's skipped. That's very, very bumpy. Uh, we're going to have to smooth that out a little bit once we get this grass out of here. That is for sure. Wow, this is incredibly bumpy up here. So while the workers were busy, I decided to go ahead and put down these greenhouses right here. These are the uh, the ones that require the seed and the fertilizer. So I'm really, really excited to use these. They're going to give me a little bit more output than the regular base game ones. As you can see, we got three of them with all of the uh, the spawn points over here on this side. I'm really excited to get to use these. As soon as we get everything else done over here on the other side of the map, we're going to come back over here and put some seed and some fertilizer in these things. What we're doing now is we're taking a windrow. Actually, hold on. I forgot. I've got to get one more thing here. We're going to go ahead and put the front rake on this also. That way I can do um, a couple different things at once. We're going to kind of clean up a little bit around the, uh, the fields with the rake on the front. And then the the TED on the back is what I want to do. 
I'm going to try and sneak in here, grab this thing right here. All right, perfect. There we go. Now, I've got to be careful. I don't know. I could probably fit through there, but I'm going to go around this way anyway. So I'm going to get this over to the grass field and get it set up, get it going. And then I'm going to get the uh, cultivator and show you guys what we've got going on over there on that field. All right, so I'm going to use this half over here as my hay and the rest of it we're gonna do silage with i've got the bunker silo over there we're gonna go ahead and put some uh grass in there and get it fermenting and uh, then we'll come back a little bit later grab it out i've got a, a tractor that new tractor we got a front loader on it the uh i'm um, gonna be able to put a bucket on that and uh, be good to go i i don't know how uh either that or i'm gonna get a different baler i, I might upgrade balers and then we'll just come over here and uh, take care of it all. But what I'm doing now, making a little bit of a headland right here. That way I can uh, go ahead and get this worker going. I wanted to clean this up a little bit and, and define my boundaries. That way the worker wasn't uh, going to try and uh, do this entire field for me. Um, so let's go ahead, set the worker off. And uh, we should, should be good to go. I'm hoping, hoping... They're not going to do anything crazy over there. But while they're doing that, we've got our other cultivator that's over here on the other side of um, this field here that we need to grab and bring it down to field number 50. So we're going to go ahead and fold it up and take it down here. And um, as you can see, tons of rocks here in this field. Um, un unfortunately, it's going to be a long drive back and forth for my worker. But I think we can do it. And I I don't know. They're having a little bit of problem over there on that other hill. Or on that other field. Because it's got a few hills in it. So I'm thinking we might, might need to get one of these other tractors um, on some of these other bigger hills. So I'm going to go ahead and get lined up right about in here. I mean, I, I don't necessarily want to go all the way over here. I mean, see... I think I'm just going to start here and see how far I get. Uh, I, I, I might not worry about the outsides here too much um, because it's going to be a pain to try and get in there. Even with the harvester, it was a it was a pain. So I think what I'm going to do is just round these off as best I can without hitting anything. And uh, that's going to be our new area that we plant crops in um, because I, uh, I just don't necessarily want to get over there and uh, have to deal with some of that stuff um, in the corners. So once again, setting the uh, the boundaries here, and then we're gonna let a worker uh, go on it. So yeah, um, I'm I'm gonna keep an eye on this worker over here and make sure they. Uh, oh, I'm gonna come back and grab that. Watching this worker over here to make sure that they don't uh, get into too much of the uh, the other grass. Why are you over there? Why why are you over there, man? I don't I don't get it. Um you're not doing what you're supposed to. So, um let me let me get this worker here going and then I'm going to come back and uh yeah. So, let's just let's just get the worker going. There we go. I'm I'm going to go figure out what's going on with this guy. I I don't know. I don't know. You you weren't supposed to do that, man. You um you need to be here for me all right there we go are you gonna drop down hey all right I mean, that's what we're making um so yeah that's that's much much better all right um you know what i think i'm just gonna go post up by that tree over there and watch these workers and make sure they're good and um well actually hold on i got rocks we got a rock picker going on over here that I need to figure out what is going on with. All right, so we actually need to hop in this one, and you are done. Yes, you are. Perfect. So we are going to go drop this off because we need to get this rock picker over in the other field, and we're going to finish up this lime too. And then these fields are going to be ready to have crops put into them. I don't quite know what crop we're going to plant yet. Um, We've got some uh, soybeans that we still need to harvest and some corn. I'm trying to figure out exactly what I want to do next. Um, 
I don't know, Sorghum maybe? That, that would be a good one. Yeah, Sorghum. But, I don't know. Let me, let me get these, this rock guy over there. That way all my tractors are just about going to be over there in that area. And then we'll, uh, we'll figure it out. Exactly what we're going to do. You know what? Scratch that because I need to get the seeds and the fertilizer here into this greenhouse. So what I'm going to do is use this front attachment here. And we're going to go ahead and uh, get these going. So I've got some pallets here. Hopefully I can get in here and pick them up pretty easy. Put down. All right. Boom, there's one. All right, perfect. Let's take this over here now and uh, put it in here and see how easy this is actually going to be. So it should just be right, right here. Hey, there we go. Perfect. All right. So if we look here on our menu, we can see that this one, no. This one now has a thousand liters of solid fertilizer in it. Perfect. So now what we need to do is go ahead and get some seeds and some water. So my neighbor was helping me get the uh, the water here out of the old stream and um, putting it into the greenhouses. He's got one of these brand new tractors right here. It looks really, really awesome. He said I could use it anytime I want to, but he... Um, I don't think he anticipated the water being quite this deep. So, uh, yeah, he went to go get another tractor because all of mine are busy. What we're going to do is go ahead and come over here and show you guys the greenhouses. So, once again, all of the product is going to go in right here. As you can see, we've got about 7,300 liters of water. We got 2,000 liters of seed and 2,000 liters of fertilizer. Now, this one I went a little bit more heavy on because I want to make, oh, strawberries. Yep. We're going to do strawberries out of this greenhouse right here. The other one, one's going to be tomatoes and one's going to be lettuce. The reason is because I'm going to make something very, very unique out of those two products. But my strawberries, I uh, I want to just kind of sell those things for a little bit. Maybe use it some cake if we can make a cake. Or there's a couple other things I can do too. Um, but I think what we're going to do is put a couple productions down. We're going to put one of them right in here. We're going to put another one right over here. It's the best place I have to be able to do this. Um, we also need to figure out when we can sell all of our harvest and buy some cows. We're going to start with cows and then we're going to get some pigs too. Maybe if I can get some, some better feed for them. So let me go ahead and show you how this is going to work. Come into our menu here. As you can see, this is the one with the um, 1,000 liters. So this one, I want to be tomatoes. And I want to make sure that it's on the one that is my fertilizer. So this one down here is manure, but this one is um, fertilizer. So we're going to go and turn this one on. I want to come here to lettuce, turn this one on. And the last one, I want to make sure it is strawberries. We've got a bunch of product in there. I'm going to run out of water before. That's why I was trying to get another uh, load here, but he's on his way back. Hopefully, I mean, you can't even see that thing over there right now. But everybody, that's going to be it for today. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you would. If you want to be kept up to date on all my future Let's Plays here on the old stream farm or any other map that we choose to do, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you do, hit that notification bell too. While you're waiting on those videos, go ahead and check out one of these other ones right here. Have a great day, night, evening, everybody. Until next time, this is Driver53 signing off.